Oh yeah, I'm Average Dad. We're back here at Anaheim. We're back here at the Packing House, bro, because we're gonna go inside and we're gonna go to the Croft because I heard that they have some great poutine. Guess who we're here with at the Packing House today? Dude, it's Alani, bro. What's going on, guys? <laughs> yeah, dude, thank you for coming out today. Of course, it was a pleasure. You know? Yeah, for sure. Thanks for having us here with you. Yeah. You know, we're ready to get our grub on. That's yeah. what I'm talking about. Exactly. So go ahead and tell us a little bit about yourselves and your channel. Hey guys, my name's Alan, and of course, this is my lovely fiance, Kanani. We do everything from theme parks, foods, of course, because we want to be here, most importantly. But what we try to do, we try to bring the vibes, just like everyone else. Of course, the main, the main person behind the camera, he is legit he lit every single time we tune into his videos. So inspirational. So, you know, we try I mean, to... We need his energy. And also, we try to bring the vibes, you know. What we preach is Ohana, and of course, ever since we met Alan, he's been Ohana from the beginning. But not only that, the love and support that he gives to us, we always try to give back as well too. Yes, we love to uh, support all you guys here um, on our channel. We love to, you know, bring it back. You guys are likewise both ways. Even though we're content creators, we are fans as well too. Yes, we are. <laughs> you guys ready to grub? Yes. Definitely, yeah. Totally okay, right man, dude, I'm ready to eat. So I yes. guess I'll guys see you guys later after yeah. we're done eating. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's go ahead and make our way downstairs because this is where we are going to find the crop and the poutine, bro. Now, I have heard recommendations that we have to try the crop, so we're back here, bro. And just look at this menu, dude. They have a massive amount of food here, but I don't know. I think we might go with the classic poutine maybe the classic poutine and the chicken parmesan oh man check it out they got a cubano here i'm for sure gonna get those because i am a fan of a good cuban so while we wait for our food man on the second floor they do have a swing where you just chill out and relax but once again go ahead and comment down below and let me know the foods that you have tried and that you like and that i need to try we have that food now let's get it out of the bag oh dude look at this cubano bro that is pretty fat and oh bro wait hold on a second i need two hands for this one this one is a big boy and first up look at this bro this is the chicken parmesan poutine let's put that one away and for the classic one This looks really, really good. Look at all that food right there. Now enough of me talking, let's dig in. Sophie and my mom dig into the poutines. I'm gonna start with the Cubano. Let's open this baby up. Oh man, dude, that looks really good. Look how toasted the outside is. And look at the shredded pork on the inside with the mustard. Now I'm a fan of Cuban. This is really, really delicious. This was a very traditional Cuban and I really enjoyed this. This was way better than the one at Porto's. What I liked about it was how crunchy the bread was. The Spanish pork on the inside was nice and tender. The smoked ham was great and the pickles were actually really, really fat. I highly recommend you going to the crop and checking out this Cuban sandwich. This Cuban sandwich is getting an easy three out of three, man. One thing I did enjoy about this Cuban is how mild the mustard is compared to other Cubans that I had. Other Cubans that I've had, you know, you get that punch of mustard in your mouth. This one was very subtle, which was nice because you can taste every single one of the flavors in that sandwich. Now it's time to dig into the braised beef poutine. Got that pickled onions on top, get some braised beef, some gravy. Oh man, look at those cheese curds. First impressions before we eat this, dude, look how hearty this one fork full of poutine looks. This braised beef poutine is crazy good, man. Just look how tender, dude, this braised beef is. And the poutine is solid. I mean, just look how nicely, dude, this cheese curd is melted. And these pickled onions top this dish up very well. This braised beef poutine is getting a solid three out of three, man. But now let's go ahead and try the other poutine, or at least what's left of it. Here's what's left of the chicken parmesan poutine. 
This poutine was pretty solid too. One thing that I really enjoyed about it was the pasta sauce. It was really robust. It had a nice little spicy kick to it, but the cheese in there was on point, man. There was cheese everywhere in this. Look at all this cheesy goodness. You know what this reminds me of, man? The chicken Parmesan sandwich that you can get at Knott's Berry Farm. This is getting an easy three out of three. So before we head up out of here, bro, we got some pop bars, man, to go. But Sophia right here, she got a butterscotch one. How does that taste? It tastes delicious. And also, when you do get your popsicle, they ask if you want it with toppings. And I got white chocolate and I got sprinkles. You can get many other options. And what do you think about it? I think it's delicious. When I tried the white chocolate, it was delicious. And the popsicle, it's not bad itself. And the sprinkles are just fine. Well, how would you rate it? I would rate it a 3 out of 3. You recommend it? Yes, I recommend it when you're here at Packing House. So we've been kicking it with the Lonnie vibes, man. Yeah. What did you guys think about your food? The food was absolutely it was amazing. Awesome. It was delicious, oh. very tasty. Oh, see, that's yeah. what I'm talking about. If you about. guys haven't been to the packing district, you guys have to come because there's a lot of unique foods and you gotta stay tuned to see what we try to Yeah. Oh, stay for tuned, sure. Guys. For sure. That's why I didn't show you any food right now because you're gonna have to go to their channel and see what they ate here, dude. So I'll put all their descriptions down below, man. For sure, subscribe, dude. You're gonna wanna follow them because they are awesome. Oh, thank you. Not, as, a, not as awesome, awesome. as Alan. No, oh, man. Yeah. Oh, wait, you're Alan. Huh? Wait a minute. That's right. You're Alan. We got two Alan. <laughs> So that's it for us today here at the packing house. But the best part is of those ice creams is they actually pack it up for you. My mom has it over there. Well, thank you to every single one of you guys for coming out today here in Anaheim. Check out us eating here at the packing house. Now remember, man, go check out Alani Vibes video if you guys want to see what they ate. But thank you to every single one of you because we cannot do this without every single one of you. Almost tripped. <laughs> haven't subscribed go ahead and go down below bro and subscribe because we love to have you on future adventures well you guys have a great day and we will catch you next video deuces